Yo, this video is for Grimly 100. Yeah, I left a lot of comments on the page, so I basically already said what I wanted to say already. Okay, reason, I know that was full of your opinions and all, but you, that's not the real reason. I mean, it's obvious that you didn't look at the other things about Barack Obama, why he really calls himself black versus biracial. Check it out. We haven't had a real leader or role model. All our role models are basketball players or football players. So what? You can catch the ball and run into a, a square and say you won. So what if you can dunk a basketball after you did a 900 degree spin, you know? Ah, man. Who gives a fuck, okay? It's not about his race intentionally. He doesn't do that intentionally. Like, oh, I sell, I call myself black, but I'm not gonna call myself biracial because you know um, they not going these niggas not gonna vote for me. That's not why, okay? Chris, he had his, he had Barack Obama had a choice. He is white and black. Good, he's white and black. Now he can go with a white woman with blonde hair and blue eyes and had kids, or he could have got a, 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 a African American woman. And you, and he obviously had his choice. He pursued Michelle. Michelle did not pursue him. Okay, he pursued Michelle. Michelle fine as hell, ain't she? Ooh -wee. <laughs> no disrespect or whatever. I'm just saying, like, Barack Obama is an inspiration to black people. White people have freaking role models. White people got their parents to be role models. Not every white person, but you know. Like, my friend, he's in college right now. He don't even want to be in college right now, and he's white. But his parents is making him go to college, and they making him become a doctor. With black people, it isn't the same. It isn't the same at all. You know what I'm saying? Like, they paying for him to go to college. I want to go to college. I want to get my education on, but I don't have the money, so I'm going to have to work my ass way through college. How is that fucking fair? Come on. Okay. White people have role models. Like, these, like, some kids have their parents. Some people look up to people like Joe Lieberman and, and, and Bill O'Reilly. People like that. That people that use their brains to, um, you know, not entertain people. Just be like, oh, I want to be like Bill O'Reilly when I grow up. It's like, why does your role model have to be your race? Simple. Especially if you're black in America. Okay, look simple i already just made it it's more than just be him being biracial we all know he's biracial we he wrote in his book that he's biracial. he wrote where he his mom was white his daddy was black is that enough for you uh, you, you, you biracial people okay you don't got to make a big deal out of it like oh we're gonna take over the world one day and, and we gotta have our own race why you want to be so separate huh i'm just saying she oh yeah greeley was like I had this video where I was talking about um, racism in the black community against biracial people. They racist against people as black as my ass. And you complaining about that? Come on. I thought you. I thought I, I thought I knew you a little better than that. Oh, this is my song. Hey, it's P Diddy back when he was puffy. But in, other than that, look. Just, just to tell just to tell you this truth. My role model growing up. My role model was Shaquille O'Neal. A person who, who gets the ball and just dunks in people's face to slam that shit. Like, mm, nigga, what? That was my role model. Now, let's say if I had kids two years ago, three years ago. It's possible. Wait, I'm 20... Let's say I had kids six years ago. He's six right now. I would want my kid not to be looking at Shaq, not to be looking at Jordan, Kobe. I want my kid to want to be like Barack. That's what I want. I don't want my kid to want to be, oh, I want to be just like Tim Brown or Jerry Rice. They're football players. They don't do nothing but play a game for money. Okay, I don't want my kid to think he want to be like Michael Vick. I want my kid to be somebody who uses their mind. Not exactly their physical body, but their mind as well. That's why Barack is black. He's not, I'm not saying, oh, he's, he's not biracial and he's not white. 
we all know that he is composed of two different races, which makes him biracial. But the reason he calls himself black is not because he don't he don't want the black people cutting him off. If that's the case, he's not really even black, okay? His daddy is African. His daddy is fucking Kenyan for Christ. For, this is pissing me off. His daddy is Kenyan. So if that's the case, black people and um, um biracial people, um I mean black people in in the community, they don't just hate against dark skinned people. They hate against Africans. African Africans. African as in I'm from Africa. African as in I might be Muslim, okay? Like that type of African, okay? They they hate against fucking Haitians. So for you to go and say he only calling himself black because uh he 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 he's not going to get any 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 support from black people he's gonna get he wouldn't get support from black people if he married a white woman which is kind of fucked up but you know what who gives a fuck <laughs> i probably wouldn't support him if he was married a white woman but then again i probably would but i'm just saying it's he wouldn't get as much support but he still if he just came out today and said i'm biracial black people still is gonna like him because he looks black he has a white nose his skin is brown his wife is black. His wife, you do you see how hard it is for her to keep that perm? That joint, be, she be sweating that joint out. His kids are black, big headed black little girls. I'm not being disrespectful. It's just true. They are black. It is a black family. They want to be a black family. They want to be a typical black family, not a typical we are biracial, multiracial family. They want to be a black family to set an example for us. Okay, we got too many fucking assholes in America. Right now, I live in a house. Right now, I live in a house. I am a foster fucking kid, okay? Why can I understand this and you cannot understand this? I'm a fucking foster kid. Right now, I live in a house with two kids who have parents with more than ten fucking 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 kids, okay? I live in a house with, uh, with two kids, two other children who have parents who had more than 10 kids each they want to be an example okay to us we need these examples we need to know that we're not oh why we why we gotta look at a white we can't we can't we can't identify with white people because white people don't want to be identified with us okay they don't want to be identified with us they don't want to be like oh we're the same you have a you have a wife you have two kids i have a wife i have two kids but we didn't grow up the same way okay you're you're your father made you go to college. I had to put my own ass through college. I had to, with, with the, the hope that I had the money to, to even try to go to college. I had the hope, okay? I had to have, I had to have heart. But this white kid, he, he can't stand up to his dad like, I don't want to go to college. I want to have a regular old job or I just want to be this, this and that. 